Hi friends, in this video we are going to understand what all the best IT courses available in the market nowadays and for freshers which courses are recommended to learn to get the job in the IT industry and for experienced people, for career gap people which courses are recommended to get the job in the IT industry all those details we are going to discuss in this video watch this video till the end to get complete information related to that and if you are not subscribed to our channel as of now then please subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon to get more updates from Ashoka IT alright let's get started we can see in the market there are several courses available like Java is available Python is available, .NET is available and UI and UX design courses available and DevOps course is available, Cloud course is available, Digital Marketing course is available, Data Science available, AI and ML courses available, Data Analytics is available, Cyber Security is available, Networking is available, Salesforce CRM Cloud is also available. I have listed down all these courses in one image. With that we are going to understand which courses are recommended for freshers, which courses are recommended for experienced people. Here you can see the top 15 courses which I have noted down here. First one Java, then Python, .NET, UI and UX Design, Software Testing, Digital Marketing, Application Development, DevOps, Cloud Computing like AWS, Azure, GCP, Salesforce, CRM Cloud, Data Science, AI and ML, Artificial Intelligence and Machine Learning, Data Analytics like Power BI, Tableau, ClickView, all those courses comes under Data Analytics, then Cyber Security and Networking Hardware is also available. Out of these 15, which courses are recommended for freshers to get the job in the industry? So I would suggest Java full stack, Python full stack, .NET full stack, UI and UX design, software testing, digital marketing, app development by using Android and iOS. These 8 or 7, these 7 courses are recommended for freshers. Java full stack, Python full stack, .NET full stack, UI and UX design. These four courses are related to one software project development. So IT companies always look for freshers for the development purpose. Right. So if you are a fresher, then these development courses along with the software testing. When I say software testing, manual testing plus automation testing using Selenium. Some companies are looking for Freshers who are having knowledge on manual plus automation testing and next one digital marketing So no need of any coding knowledge here nowadays for every company the digital marketing is very very important So if you are a fresher then you can go with this digital marketing also If you are not interested with the coding and all that stuff then digital marketing is the best option if you are interested with the coding and all, then you can go with Java, Python, .NET, UI, then software testing and app development. When I say app development, here mobile apps development, iOS and Android you can learn in order to develop mobile apps. Okay, These 7 courses are highly recommended for the freshers to get the job. I have seen some people who completed their graduation this year, they will ask me can I learn DevOps and AWS Cloud in order to get the job? Strongly, I don't suggest these DevOps Cloud courses for the freshers. You can learn them, but companies will not consider freshers for these positions. So if you are having some career gap, like 3 years, 4 years career gap, or if you are already working in the IT industry from 3 years, then it is recommended to go with this DevOps cloud computing, right? then data science, AI and ML, data analytics, these courses are recommended for experienced people. For freshers, they are not at all recommended because 
you cannot get the job in the IT industry as a fresher with these skills because companies are not looking for that. So if you want to go as a DevOps engineer, minimum three to four years of experience is required. IT companies are expecting that much experience from the candidate to work on DevOps tools and cloud computing. Right, for freshers, Java full stack, Python full stack, .NET full stack, UI UX design, web development, software testing, manual plus automation, digital marketing, if you are not interested with the coding, then you can go for digital marketing. If you are interested with the app development, mobile apps for Android and iOS, app development is also recommended for the freshers. If you are having a career gap, 3 years gap, 4 years gap, or you are working in some non-IT, now you want to switch to IT, or you are working as a developer, now you want to upgrade your skill set to the cloud and all, then DevOps, Cloud Computing, when I say Cloud Computing, AWS, Azure, GCP. So these courses are recommended for experienced people. And Salesforce CRO, Salesforce Cloud also you can learn if you are having some career gap. Then data science, AI and ML. Nowadays some freshers are going for data science course. What you will understand in the data science without having knowledge on application development. So AI ML courses are trending in the market, but freshers cannot understand that level. Right, next one data analytics, Power BI, Tableau, ClickView, those courses comes under data analytics. These courses also for experienced people only. Then cyber security and networking. If you are having some career gap, then you can go with these courses and you can cover that gap and you can try for the jobs in the IT industry. So I hope you got the clarity. What are the best courses available in the market nowadays? I have listed top 15 courses here and I have divided courses for freshers as well as for experienced people. So if you see this part. These first seven courses are highly recommended for freshers to get the job. And the remaining courses are available 8 to 15. Right? These courses are recommended for experienced people and the people who are having some career gap also. So nowadays AI is trending in the market. Can I learn AI as a fresher? Yes, as a fresher you can learn full stack. Along with that, if you learn this AI, then that is an advantage for you. Why? Because nowadays, people are copying the code from ChatGPT and they are using in the project. How to search the code in the ChatGPT? So earlier, we used to teach people how to search for code in the Google, how to get that code, how to keep that code in our project, how to modify according to our project requirement. Nowadays, people are searching for the code in the ChatGPT instead of Google. So to search for the code in the ChatGPT, you should know how to ask the ChatGPT. That is called prompt engineering. So if you know that prompt engineering, then you can complete your work in the less amount of time. AI also you can learn. But only with AI, getting the job as a fresher is very, very, very difficult in the IT industry. So I hope you got the clarity. What are the top 15 courses available in the market? And which courses are recommended for freshers? Which courses are recommended for experienced people? I will consider this is part 1 and this is part 2. Part 1 courses are recommended for freshers. Part 2 courses are recommended for experienced people. I hope this information is useful for you. So please leave your opinion as a comment on this video. And please like this video and share with your friends also. I will see you in the next video.